Hello everyone, Physics Prof here. Yeah, I was delighted to uh, be a part of this pulse motor build off this year as a judge. Uh, so, you know, these were all so close, so very uh, interesting. I reviewed about tw two dozen uh, videos um, for the build off. It's difficult to choose. And so um, I did concur pretty much with the choices by the first and second place judges. Uh, for the third place, I chose Natsud 1 in the Novice Arena. He did some measurements, which is very important to me as a physicist. Okay, I'd encourage you to try to make good measurements. I'll give you an example in a minute, but uh, Natsud 1 did some pretty good measurements. The advanced category, I like the video by Limitless. He had an interesting idea for a source of energy. So originality, cleverness comes into play. And um, I thought his description of how he put things together was very well done. So, you know, mind that video and your descriptions of things. Excellent work this year. Lots of fun. Congratulations to everyone. Oh, I just wanted to show you real quick this little motor here uh, designed by Slider. And it kicks right along. It's running on a power supply right now. But notice the power supply reads 1.2 volts and, of course, can't read the milli as zero on the milliamp scale. Here we can pick up the milliamps. It's more like uh, 270 maybe. <laughs> it does vary. And the voltage about 1.272 uh, volts. Aha. Okay. And uh, so you see it's important to read the voltage to get the accuracy. This uh, power supply just doesn't give you very good accuracy on that. Okay, gentlemen, see you next year, and good work. Hi, this is Mark Danzi with the results of the 2012-2013 Pulse Motor Build-Off. Now, I'm reporting from the Philippines here, so if you hear any chicken noises, rooster noises, or anything else in the background, do not be alarmed, especially savage dogs. First of all, I want to congratulate everybody on a great effort. I really took some time looking at this. I use slightly different judging criteria than what Zero used and other judges. He was more technical and fuddy-duddy engineering. I look for the thought process, imagination, use of resources and encouragement. And we've been told, or I was told, we had two categories. We had advanced and we also had novice and I'm sorry I'm looking at the notes but there's so many entries and so many things I want to make. First of all, if he could have been uh, able to enter, Russ would have won this hand down. So I'm not uh, crawling up to the boss but extraordinary effort as per usual from Russ. So well done Russ and uh, sorry you can't be judged. Next one I want to congratulate and there's a point I want to make. Where do you guys get all these names from? I mean, I can't pronounce half of them. Can't it be Mark 1, 2, 3 or whatever? I mean, some of these names I've got troubles with. But however, apart from that, if it was based purely on fun and creativity, Cultus, the desert guy, you'd win it hands down in my opinion. But I had to be fair to everybody else, but I really, really, really got a kick out of that. In fact, I've told a few people about that entry and uh, what a great imagination, what a great effect, well done. So you get my, uh, I haven't got a prize, but uh, I really liked it. Now, getting down to second place in the advanced, I had three finalists. Luke, uh, L-U-Q-U, E, I hope I got that name. I'm going to call it Luke, Luke, Limitless, and Earthfinder. You can see what I mean by the names. Luke, you absolutely get first place. Original thought, I'm reading some notes. Original thought, compressed magnetic field, induction. What a great effort. Highly original. I wasn't caring about the result. I just like to see the process, the imagination, the build, the uh, philosophy, the logic behind it, that was outstanding and that was my number one. Number two was limitless, simplicity, cost effective, resourceful, great stuff and it's what I expect from you anyway mate, uh, that's really really cool build. 
and finally Earthfinder. Uh, great machining, a little bit advanced for the criteria I'm judging on. Brilliant craftsmanship, brilliant motor. I thought you did an outstanding effort as well. However, on my criteria, I have to give it to Luke and what an outstanding effort, way beyond the means that I thought would be required. I'll move on now. Our second place, I had three finalists. You are coffee. Where do you get the name from? Diadon. I hope I've got this how you guys want to pronounce it right. And Luciano. I got that one right. They are my three finalists. Now, Diadon and You Are Coffee, I couldn't separate you. In fact, Diadon, I had you higher. But You Are Coffee, I don't know. There's something when I first saw your uh, video, I wanted to show it to other people and said, hey, this is cool. This is simple. This is something I could even do. And I like the simplicity. So I consider the Novice Award more of an encouragement award. So you get my second place, if that makes sense. You're number one in second place. Died on close second and Luciano loved it I really really loved it so I don't know how to edit these results or to show segments of your video I'll leave that to people more clever than I I only managed to get my video camera up yesterday that's why this is late so all I can say is spectacular effort I really really encourage all you guys working at home experimenting because collectively you're contributing to the knowledge of everybody and we never know when one of you will make a discovery or a discovery that can trigger off the imagination of somebody else and move things forward. And I thought this particular effort this year was way above anything I was expecting and you should all be very proud of yourselves. Every single entry. Thank you very much. So Oh, pff, what? Where are we, first of all? I don't know. <laughs> we're, we, we're in somewhere in Colorado. Okay. We're somewhere in Colorado. Hey everyone, Zero Fossil Fuel. I'm in Boulder, Colorado with my, with my mini-me, Russ Grease. Hey. Hey. Mini-me, you complete me. I'm scared right now. <laughs> this is kind of scary. And we're here to announce the winners of the Pulse Motor Build-Off 2013. All right. Uh, real briefly, I'm going to just give my picks in the uh, advanced category. I'm, Wait, uh, before we do that, I'd like to s just tell everyone that even put an effort in, even if you didn't promote what you did online, that we're all winners in this field of what we're trying to do. So the people that we pick are not the winners because they're the only ones who did what they did or that we like them the best. It's just the fact that we have to pick someone to present a competition in this field, but everybody agreed. Is, agreed. Is and, and I mean, it's yeah. Yeah, it was amazing. All the entries that we had this year, twenty-four entries. Yeah. That's phenomenal. That's, that was, that's that was phenomenal. Great. That's yeah. that's really great. Uh, but anyway, the the judging was really close this year. Very difficult to judge. Every single one of our judges I know had a tough time making their decisions. We all, after we've made our decisions, uh, consult, consulted with each other and we all agreed pretty much as to, as to what our choices were. But again, very tight. Thank you all for your entries. It was a great, a, a lot of fun this year. And can we do it again next year? Yeah, the, the categories are not going to be announced publicly, but we do have the categories in second and third places. So, all right. Here we go. So for first place in the, <laughs> sorry, drum roll. It's a bad drum. In the advanced category. <laughs> in the advanced category, we have Christian Alba. Uh, congratulations, Christian. I don't know what we're, what we have set aside for prizes. They're they're still to be sorted, but okay. But there's basically two of basically everything, but the oscilloscope goes to top prize, um, I believe in the invoice, in the non in the non voice I say invoice. in the novice category. I, I believe so. So that okay. I, I'm fairly certain that the oscilloscope that Tin Man donated okay. goes to that individual. Okay. Well that individual in the novice category first place goes to Totalis. Uh, yes. setup was messy as hell, 
but uh, <laughs> but impressive. It was impressive what he did, and much of my decision was based on many of the uh, the results that he obtained with his with his pulse motor. It was very impressive. Totalis, congratulations, uh, and uh, I can't wait to see what you build for us again next year. Yeah, fantastic, and uh, interestingly, there's been a quite a few people here, and one of the people that is here is this gentleman right here. And I'm not going to say who it is because you'll know who it is. <laughs> Let's find out. All right. This guy. What? Hold it up. What, what is this? <laughs> what is, what is, is this? It's a piece of art right now. <laughs> it is a piece of art. That's exactly right. <laughs> this, this is Fire Pinto's Pulse Motor Build-Off. Hey, man. Hey, man. I will have to say that this is probably the most interesting thing that I've seen constructed. And this is actually my favorite pick of the whole competition. And I tucked away a levitator in your box that you probably saw. Oh, and really? That is your, <laughs> oh, that, is, you. <laughs> that is from me for this competition because this, this is crazy. You the spent the last... The amount of work that this represents is phenomenal. Yeah, well, you spent the last three days literally getting to this point. It was just stuff scattered throughout <laughs> well, the garage or wherever you're at. month was printing in the yeah. last three days. Was right. insane, yeah, right? it was. <laughs> it was absolutely amazing. So Well done. Awesome. Well Th done. Glad you're here. Oh, and what did you say earlier about live streaming and being in this room with these two people? Well, you said something oh. about... Oh, there's no lag. There's no lag there's tag no right lag. now. <laughs> <laughs> no typing. It's live in the footage. So. Anyway, just want to say thank you very much. Come on in here. Come, come on come in, in here. We just, uh, we, ju we just had your own Van Stratton jo yeah, join us. Yeah, check it out. Hello, hello, people. <laughs> we, are, we are doing the Pulse Motor Build-Off winner video right now. Uh -huh. and you just happen to be here, and this gentleman has basically made the global BDM actually happen yeah. uh, along with all of the other people but you're the people that you, you know people see you as that main focus and so uh, but there were a couple of people missing uh, Gary yeah. Endershot was not here Mark, yeah. Mark, Mark Dancy was not here Kevin right. Brun was not here so I hope that you're gonna come next awesome. time yeah okay. All right, everyone. Fantastic. thank you we're gonna be in the arcade and uh, yeah. please don't kick okay. the camera no. oh. okay <laughs> thank you bye bye all right Fantastic. Guys. That's all for now from, from Boulder, Colorado. Thank you all for entering the Pulse Motor Build Off, Zero Fossil Fuel, and Rust Grease. Peace, everybody. And, uh, and, and, and JD. Hey, yeah, and Fire JD. Yeah, okay. We're, this is great. And we had a fantastic volunteer earlier to do some serious filming that we had to kick out on accident. Uh, that was interesting. And it's been fantastic being here. It's been oh, yeah. I'm done. Okay. okay. <laughs> See you guys. Oh, what's up, everybody? So first of all, thank you guys for being so patient. I do apologize. It took so long to get these into And that was cool. So uh, yeah, back to the video. Thank you guys. Sorry it took so long. And um, it was absolutely crazy. The whole last couple of weeks have been insane, and it just took way longer than I thought. Um, Mark Danzi has been having some problems with his with his camera. Ten Man, uh, he doesn't have internet right now, so his final entry pick will be posted later. 
and uh, it's just crazy. So, um, the couple of important announcements I have to actually share with you on the end of this video here is that um, everybody that won, won during the actual competition is going to be um, invited to the Smart Scarecrow Show. Um, we do that through Skype and it can be audio only. And so hopefully you'll join us. Um, it should be basically the judges if we can get them and anybody that entered and we'll just kind of go have a round table discussion about the whole entire thing. It's actually a lot of fun. I really encourage you guys to come and join us. I'll, I will be sending out emails. Uh, the Smart Scarecrow Show will be on November and I'll give you the times in your emails. I will be sending out emails to the winners and I'll be asking for your addresses so I can ship you your prizes. And um, I tried to organize the prizes somewhat uh, on the correct levels and it was kind of really hard to pick who got what and why and I just kind of wrote down a list and that's what I came up with. So hopefully, uh, hopefully uh, that's okay with you guys. So anyway, that's all I got to say. I just wanted to share that with you and let you know that I really, really, really appreciate everybody's entry. It was actually a lot of fun and um, I really could see some, some encouragement from people and I want to thank the people who donated prizes and just everybody awesome 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 um, getting people involved working together that's really what it's all about sharing knowledge and uh, it's, been, it's been awesome so the Shazazz show as well I will be sending out an email to basically everybody that entered and I'll just send out a mass email uh, to everybody on my emailing list so that if you want to come join the Shazaz show, it's in the morning on a Saturday. Um, for me, it's in the morning. I'll get you the correct time. And if you want to come, just join the conversation through Skype again. It's o it's audio only. It's actually a radio show by Shazaz. I'll link it in the description. I'll link Gary's show in the description as well in case uh, you guys want to watch it. But yeah, a lot of awesome stuff happening. And Russ out. Peace and love to you guys. Thank you so much for joining. And um, we'll see you later. Hopefully you enjoyed all the, all the awesome clips. Woohoo! Peace and love. Peace out, guys. See ya.